Well, great and salutations. Welcome to the next installment of Until Dawn. As we are picking up with Mike going somewhere on his own like a wild and crazy person. And so without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into this stuff. Because I'm telling you, if you didn't see the last part, it was absolutely insane. Um, yeah, because we got to see the Wendigos for the first time. And so now we're picking up this story with the mic. Heading off down into the tunnels back to the sanatorium. Something to do with looking for a key so they can get off the mountain. Sorry, I'm focusing up here. But yeah, because, um, yeah, the last episode, oof, man. Talk about intense AF. Okay, that's a dead end over there. Yeah, I guess he can't get in there. That's cool. Yeah, so greet salutations. Welcome, everybody. Thanks for all the love and support on the channel. As always, it is greatly appreciated. Take a look around here. You always got these sketchy little corners off in here that uh, usually hide in some things. Nothing there. Let's check over in this corner. That looks like you should be able to get through there, but that's a dead end. There's nothing clicking there. Nope, nothing up against there. All right, man, stairs it is. Gowdy. You know, what's so funny, too, is, uh, I mean, yeah, I'd be grabbing one of these boards or something. Laundry room. Man, I don't remember that last time we came up here. picture so I mean we'll go ahead and I'll pick it up real quick. One nine five two yep, this was the miracle man. Miracle man. Yeah I think thirty miners went down and there was a cave in and uh twelve came out looking fully nourished and healthy and all that good stuff and Like they've been eating something. I wonder what on earth it could have been. But yeah, as we know now, that's, uh, yeah, they reverted to cannibalism and started eating their compadres. I guess on this spirit mountain, that is a no-no. And if, um, 
you do that, it releases the spirits of the mountain, referred to as Wendigos. And in the last part, we just saw a Wendigo. And they are fast as hell. Not cool. Yeah, I mean... Oh. Shit. Huh. What happened on the walls? Huh. True. Uh oh, he's starting to hear that dramatic music. Yeah, there's like two shiny objects back there. Trick is, how do we get back there? Let's see if we can find a key at the desk or something. Yeah, we got all that. Yep, did that. Nothing there. Okay then. This is a cigar. Yeah, and there was a chest up here last time. And I was hoping the key would just be sitting right up there on the altar. Like handcuffs there. There's a key inside here. Yoink. All right, we'll, we'll hit that up in a second. Let's uh, just scope out the rest of this area here. Because maybe we need a key. Maybe there might be a key that's around out here. It's like I'm hearing footsteps. Check this door here real quick. Oh, the, not a... Let's go up these stairs real quick. We went up these stairs last time, to be honest. Uh-huh. Yoink. Take that shotgun and look at all those shotgun shells. I just need a pitchfork and a mob. Nice. 
Hell yeah. Sawed off uh, shotgun, double barrel. Enough. Indeed. Aren't you gonna load that thing? Boy, that's crazy. Man, I'm glad we checked that out. I feel a little bit better with uh, a little bit of firepower in our right hand there. Yeah, if you guys remember, Mike lost two of his fingers too, so doing a pretty good job holding that torch with just two fingers. <laughs> That's so crazy. <clears throat> oh, no, 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 no. Let's not do that. didn't want to make all that noise. Hey, big guy. That's our friend. Happy to see me again, huh? Hey. Just hoping I'd run into you again. All right. Good boy. All right, pal. You're coming with me. All right. Here's the plan. I happen to see a map of this place, so we're not flying blind. There should be a way through the psychiatric wing that'll take us right outside the mine. Think you can handle that? Couldn't have said it better myself. Nice. Ah, ah, boy. I got no control. Wanted to check out the other room on the other side. Please? Yes. Wolfie, you stand guard right there. Because we open this one up. I mean, take a look around. Can't go back in through there. Okay. Ah. A red totem. Ooh, That's a danger totem. Man, 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 man. Yeah, that's Mike fighting off a Wendigo. Hmm. Yeah, I wonder when that's going to pop up. Let's go back over to Wolfie real quick. I'm feeling good with him around. Wolfie the wolf dog. There he is. Nice. Well, this is pretty crazy. We're following Wolfie. No entry, danger, death. Wow, okay. Good dokey boy, calm down. Hmm. Wish I could move like you, Wolfie. Right? I'm stuck on this side. Crazy. The, um, 
since Wolfie's handling the business there. Ooh, and I'm not liking the sound of that at all. Nothing around here. Boy, that camera ain't man, I'm telling you. Yeah, something about this like chain link fence, man, is throwing me off because uh, the other side where we found the red totem, it opened to the outdoors. So we're going to do due diligence and uh, check out the back backyard of the other side. Oh, Mike, you got this, bro. Just keep on going. There you go. You got this, buddy. Use them bro powers. Yeah, I wanted to go back to link back up to Wolfie. But what's all this out here? Oh, and we got something twinkling right here. Holy hell. All the crosses bear the same date, 24th February, 1952. What happened to make so many people die on the same day? That is, um... Man, this must... I don't know if they found the dead bodies down in the mines or, or not. But, okay. This looks like this was a dead end. Got it. We did get a clue out of the deal, so... Now we scoped this room, so... Ah, back to the creepy place. That's crazy to still see our footprints in the snow. Yeah, I'd only saw him grab a handful of shotgun shells. But, I mean, it would be nice to know. Okay, that's a dead end. Oh, and that's... I saw something twinkling right there on that door. Nothing. Oof. Looks like a demon lever. Come on, go back out through there. Nope, you can't make it in between those barrels. Okay, we tried. to pull on the demon lever. All right. There goes nothing. Right? Awesome. What in the hell, man? Now we just locked ourselves in this cage? Got moves. Don't I, Wolfie? Well, I can tell her I'm glad we got this torch. Once again, I just hope it's a, a forever torch. Okay, now it finally out a little bit tension area wow 
Holy macanoli, dude. Look at all this blood on the wall. What do we got here? Hmm. Huh. Doctor's report. Um, ba -ba -ba -um, symptoms. Uh, skin disignitation. This pigmentation. Uh, severe vitamin D deficiency. No longer ad average. Adaptation period post traumatic event, interpersonal behavior, erratic violence towards orderlies, three attempted assaults, one attempted scratching, malnutrition, scurvy, hmm, continued frailty, weakness, place under strict observation, restraint, strongly recommended, change from one orderly to three orderlies, 24 hours a day, observation. Wow. Yeah, there it is. A uh, report by Dr. Brown notes several serious irregularities in some recent patients. It appears that the patients were undergoing some sort of physical change. Uh, initial reports, the patients were first admitted to Blackwood's medical facility five days ago. During this time, we have run a number of tests, both psychological and psychological. Oh, physiological and psychological. The results have been extraordinary in contravention of common medical expectations. Uh, and then the skin disorders, malnutrition, scurvy. Patient stimulus response with acceptable frostbite. Frail weakness suggested. Okay, we're good. Like that room is thoroughly scouted. Woof, what is all this? Fresh, too. Oh, son of a bitch. Jesus Christ. Seriously. And I'm telling you, this latter part of the game, sketchy AF. Huh. These doors were built like tanks. How crazy were these inmates? That's not inmates, my friend. That is not inmates. Look at those claw marks. There's only three. These are demons. Just scoping out that room there. goes one right there just climbed up the wall what does that say on the wall there e-wing wow there's a hole in the ceiling right there What on earth are we doing, man? This is no bueno. The camera ain't I'm telling you. It's impossible. Doctor's office. Wolfie going here. Film projector.
course there's electricity for it. Wow. Boy, he took off his own restraints. Hold a Spider-Man. Hell yeah. Gonna be out the door. Man, see how fast they are? Those things are ridiculously fast. What the fuck is going on? Let's see. Uh, restrained patient seems to turn into some sort of creature and become violent. It attacks the people making the film. Rip. I'm around here. Boy, how far back does this go? Doctor's office. Oh, one of these things. Look at that. Psychiatric ward. Extreme nasal septum something. Ectodermal dysplasia. Chronic osis. Screamy apoplasia. Jesus, hot sauce Christmas cake. We'll get back to that, Mike. Hold on. Here's a photo found called Billy Bates. They show a transformation of several days. By the end, the miner was clearly becoming a Wendigo. Now, epidermal pigmentation, severe curvature of the thor thorax region, post-traumatic aphosis, corneal dystrophy, and clouding. Ooh. Chronic kyphosis. Scarring of alopecia, extreme nasal septum perforation, ectodermal dysplasia, pointing of teeth. Wow, man. No boy, ain't this is fucking unbelievable. True. True. gonna be shooting. Holy crap, dude. Man, old boy isn't playing. Holy shit. Who is this guy? Oh man, I hope Wolfie's alright. I don't know where my dog's at. He's gonna jump out and get us. Sorry, I'll do it. It's alright. I don't need it anymore. We're dying outside. Suicide note signed by Jefferson Bragg. He locked himself in his safe room and took poison. He seems to be describing some sort of massacre outside. They're dying outside. I hear them screaming and crying. The hell, this hell is my only legacy. 
God's punishment for my mistakes. No escape escaping my fate. Death awaits me now. Senior Jefferson Bragg. Yes. I'm at peace now. Got some Molotov cocktails around here or something like that, brother. Sulfuric acid, maybe? That'd be awesome. Well, that was quite the little adventure there. Nothing back in this corner, okay. This is back over to Wolfie. Yep, that's dead end. We're good. We out this bitch. Now yeah, that's that creepy movie. Now yeah, time to head over to the B wing. I think we came in that way. What the hell was this room? Yeah, we came in this way. Yeah, B-Wing signs right there above me. Jeez, losing it. I'm losing it. Doctor's office, detention area. Look at the dog. He's just sitting there staring up there. He's like telling you, bruh, something out there, and I don't think you want to go out there. Hmm. Ah. Don't need to shoot that man. They're not shooting that. Fucking rat. Ah! Ah! That's for you, fuck. That did nothing to him, man. Better get going, bro. Still has a shotgun. Hmm.
Well, Wolfie knew where to go. All he had to do was follow the dog. Be like a stay really still one, yep. Buddy, we're going. from behind you. Huh? Damn it. What the? What? I see you. It's enough for me for all ya! Huh? Just light all these guys up. I don't know how many shots I have. Okay. event stuff is killing me. You're crushing it, buddy. His bro powers are definitely activated. Yeah, just looking to see if there's like collectible here, but also just kind of take a break because I think we're kind of safe back here. I don't know why this big hole in the floor is like right there, but it's not letting me jump up there. Like a vine up there. All right, man, whatever. I guess we're moving on. Psychiatric ward again.
You know, where is Wolf yet? Outside, he's kind of out in the open right now. book somewhere, you know, if you burn them. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, it releases their spirit. But... And screw you guys, dude. Yep, and he can't walk this way. Any of these doors open? No. Nope. That door? Nope. Come on down. It's all right. Come on, Wolfie. Let's go, buddy. Okay, buddy. Hey, I'll catch you on the flip side, huh? Oh, man. Well, he's lived this long. y'all we are going to take a pause for the cause right there because this is some creepy AF, af stuff but anyhow wanted to say thank you for stopping in and if you enjoyed this episode i uh, appreciate a uh, sub on the channel it definitely helps until then my friends i will and i shall catch you on the other side peace